Hey guys, so today I'm making cheesy garlic mashed potatoes and the cheese I'm going to be using for this mashed potatoes is Gouda cheese. And the potatoes I'm using is regular red potatoes. You can also use Yukon gold potatoes or even russet potatoes, that's fine too. But I like the color of red potatoes and mashed potatoes so I'm using it today okay so the first thing I'm gonna do is um, I already washed and scrubbed my potatoes so I'm just gonna cut the potatoes in about fours and I'm adding it into a pot with water and I'm gonna let it boil after that okay and as usual I'm gonna leave um, the ingredients and measurements in the description box down below for you guys to check it out there so I'm just gonna add in a little bit of salt and I'm gonna put my potatoes to boil until they're really soft so we can make the mashed potatoes okay so once the potatoes start boiling I'm gonna add in a chopped roughly chopped up six cloves of garlic I'm gonna add it in with the potatoes and let that cook with it so the potatoes are finished as you can see they're very soft breaking apart so they're good okay so I'm just gonna mash the potatoes a little bit before I add some other stuff into it just to break it up a little all right okay so now I'm gonna add in some so I'm gonna add in a little bit of garlic powder and onion powder okay so I added in some onion powder some garlic powder I'm also gonna add in some black pepper if you have white pepper use that instead for color purposes so you will see you know the black pepper in your mashed potatoes but I don't have any on hand right now so I'm using black pepper okay Okay, so now I'm going to add in one cup of warm whole milk. And I'm also going to add in some butter. And make sure that the butter that you're using is a good quality butter. So I'm using Kerrygold Pure Irish Butter. Okay. And now I'm gonna mash the potatoes and mix everything together to incorporate it and let it blend really well. I have one more thing to add. I just wanna ma mash it up a little. Okay. So, the last thing I'm adding in is the gouda cheese so I'm using seven ounces of the cheese but you can um, if you want it cheesier you could use more or less but this was perfect for me and yeah I'm just gonna mix it together and of course I shredded the cheese before adding it So just make sure you really mix the mashed potatoes really well to incorporate the ingredients into it. And once you're finished mixing it, we're going to taste it and make sure we the seasonings is right. So
So I'm gonna add in a little bit more salt and a little bit more black pepper. Much better. So yeah, that's why it's really important to taste your food before you finish cooking it. Make sure you don't need to add any more of your seasoning, salt, black pepper, some more onion powder or garlic powder or whatever. So this is basically done. You could stop at this step if you want and this will be like the end of your cheesy garlic mashed potatoes sometimes I like to uh, make it a little more fluffy and creamy by using my cake mixer with a whip attachment and just whipping it for a few seconds so yeah I'm gonna whip it for a few seconds just to make it a little fluffier And that is it guys, you could garnish your mashed potatoes with some parsley on top. And that's it. Cheesy garlic mashed potatoes using Gouda cheese. Really delicious. But yeah, so that is it for this recipe you guys. You can see the mashed potatoes is very creamy it's cheesy it's really delicious I'm just gonna garnish mine with a little bit of butter on top and yeah tonight I'm serving it with some um, sweet chili salmon which I'm gonna post that video really soon so it'll be on my channel also but yeah that's it for this recipe thank you guys so much for watching this video i hope you enjoyed it give it a try let me know if you liked it and i will see you in my next video guys bye